What's going on, y'all? I have been a WWE fan since the early 80s. Even though they have AEW. Now, AEW is a good show, but I've always been on the side of WWE. Always. I never left the WWE. I never really... I may take a few months off of it because... The shows get boring. They really do, especially Raw. And without Roman Reigns, SmackDown will be absolutely horrible. And some people are going to say, oh, you're going to talk about something other than EDP? Yeah, I am. This is it right here. I'm going to do one last video on EDP, but right now we're not going to talk about him. When a wrestler signs... For a contact, you know, sport like, you know, wrestling, you know, when he signs on the dotted line, a wrestler knows the risk. It's just like in any other sport, football, hockey, uh, boxing, MMA, you know the risk. I felt ashamed. I felt bad that Big E broke his neck. And he may be out for a long time. But what we cannot do is blame the person that accidentally broke his neck. Rich Holland did a German suplex on Big E. And we all know how big Big E is. He's a big guy. You know, doing a move like that on a big guy is a risk. Just like any other move, that's a high risk in uh, WWE. Haven't we seen Big E um, run through the ropes? That's... That's a risk that you take, you know? It's a lot of moves that Big E does that's risky. We all, we all enjoy the entertainment. But the wrestlers risk their life to entertain us. And sometimes when you're trying to entertain people, you are going to do things that are questionable. For big people, they do things that they shouldn't do, right? But this wasn't the case of Big E. Big E was on the other side of that. He was the one that uh, basically had a move that was risky that someone put on him and risked, and risked uh, his body. You know what I'm trying to say. They did a German, and it went kind of bad, and he landed more on his head than on his back. We all know what a German suplex is. He landed more on his head than on his back. But a move like that on a guy like Big E, you know, it's a hit or miss. You know what I'm saying? It's something that can go well, something that, can happen like this. Um, I feel bad that Big E is going to be out for a while. WrestleMania is four weeks away. I'm pretty sure Big E is not going to be able to return to WrestleMania. I'm pretty sure that right there is no doubt in my mind. When will he return? It may be a while. But, you know, it's, it's like I said, man, like the wrestlers go high, you know, and above to entertain us, you know, no matter what that they do, they know the risk. Everybody knows the risk in all kind of contact sports. They all know the risk.
what could be put on you and what you can do to somebody else. I hate to see Big E looking like this in the hospital. I, I wish I can give support to him too. Uh, uh, speedy recovery, Godspeed, man. That's all I can do, man. That's all I can say. I wish I could do more. I don't like to see things like this because Big E was a WWE champion. He was a good WWE champion. And, and you know, him, Kofi doesn't really have a partner right now. You know, they could have been, they was in the hunt for the tag team championship. They was there. They was about to be in that tag team championship, uh, the three-way, something like that. Three-way tag team or something like that. And then this happens. And, and, and you know, I feel so bad because Big E is going to be out of WrestleMania. Nobody wants to be out of WrestleMania. Nobody. Four weeks before WrestleMania, and this happens. But I don't bring, I don't blame Rich Holland. I swear I don't. I don't. He took a risk too. He didn't know. He thought it was going to go well. He didn't know that Big E was going to land on his head. Germans, German suplexes. Sometimes you got to really know how to do it, especially to a big guy. You can't go. Uh, how to say it? To a big guy, you got to go low. You can't go high on a big guy. Like, for instance, you can go high. You can go, like, throwing someone high like uh, Ricochet. Because Ricochet, he can land on his feet on a German. I don't know. You know, if you throw him. But a big guy like Kofi, you got to throw low. You got to go low. I, you know, I hope y'all understand what I'm saying with this. But Ridge didn't do that. He went a little too high and Big E landed on his neck. And now he's out. But let's not blame Ridge Holland. Let's not do that. You know, it's, it's a risk, man. It's all I can say. It's a risk. It's a risk that wrestlers take. I'm guaranteed he didn't mean to do it on purpose because if he did, Rich Holland would have not have came to see Big E in the hospital. He felt just as bad. He felt terrible. But he also knew the risk of doing the move. It is all to entertain the fans. But he did not do it on purpose. I'm pretty sure I could put money on that. He did not mean to do it on purpose. So let's not blame Rich Holland. It's a risk you take. Big E, you probably won't see this video. And I know you got all the prayer requests and, and, and everything and support and, you know, and everyone's saying how much of a nice guy you are and, and God bless you and, and hope you get better and everything. And I hope so too, man. You know, I don't like the gyrating you do. <laughs> I know you ain't going to get rid of it because that's your thing. You gyrate. That's your thing. I don't like that. But you bring out the best of the new day. You're the one who does it. You know, and you got to come back, man. You really do got to come back. And, we you know, we're going to miss you. You're going to be out of action for a while, man, and, and I'm going to miss you especially, you know. It's not because, you know, you're, you're a black wrestler and we need to support our black wrestlers, but there's not much going on on SmackDown, man. There's not much going on on Raw, you know, and I like to see you and Kofi together as a tag team, and I hate that you're going to miss WrestleMania, man. Oh, my God, I hate that. So... One fan to somebody who is, uh, a, you know, a, someone who is a big-time wrestler, speedy recovery, and Godspeed.